rain poured into some subway stations and also flooded buses led to many service disruptions. And the MTA just gave us an update just a short time ago. CBS 2's Alice Gaynor, she was there and she's live at Grand Central Terminal with more on that. Alice? Maurice and Christine, we just wrapped up with MTA officials. They say subway service was disrupted the most in Brooklyn. As for the rails, it was Metro North that suffered the most. Behind me, this is a live look at the crowd here at Grand Central Terminal. They say the good news is that when it comes to Metro North, they were able to restore one of three lines for the Hudson Line. When it comes to bus service, they say 34 buses out of 3,500 were stranded today, but they do say bus service is the most reliable, and you should take that. From Queens to Brooklyn, the water poured in underground. As you see, everybody's waiting, a big crowd. We have to get an alternate route. The one train is out. As a result, this man was left contemplating how to get to his office. Thankfully, my office is about a mile away. Worst comes to worst, I'll walk. Unlikely I'll get a cab. Uh, buses are packed. Prior to the storm, the MTA said water in the system would be inevitable, especially with flash flooding. They gave an update this afternoon after a day full of issues. I'm asking and urging all New Yorkers to continue to be vigilant, and the state of New York will always be there prepared in advance. We have thousands of DOT members and three authority crews and utility crews ready to assist. I've deployed the National Guard. And the best thing you can do if you can is please stay home. New Yorkers heeded the governor's warning and the warnings that the MTA put out yesterday. We had very low commuter levels. Our focus right now is getting everybody home safely. Officials urged people to stay home if possible, but many could not. I just came to take a train to go to White Plains. They said there's no train at all. Best of luck to everybody else as well, because we're all dealing with the same rain. And when it comes to subway service, the latest update, they say they were able to restore the following lines, A, C, D, E, J, M, Q, and 7. They are cross-honoring, but like you heard, the best thing you can do, if possible, is to stay home. Live at Grand Central Terminal, Alice Gaynor, CBS 2 News.